Just finish me quick. So she's uh, like, literally. I have heard. <laughs> Sad. I have always dreamed of a peaceful place like this. Occurred. That's it. So that's that's it. Hello, and welcome back to Metal Gear Solid. I'm gonna continue this shit. Get a recording done. Um, so yeah, back for retro pitch pixels. You know this is going on. Each Sunday, me and Abby hit a retro game. This is my pick. So it's a bottle of water, but like, it's one of them like bottles where it's fucking just a bit. Every time I get caught up by this, don't I? But yeah, let's get into it. Just, yeah, I don't even remember where I was up to. I'm, I'm, that, I'm guessing it's that one. I'm hoping it's this one. Because I've fucking done that helicopter and I don't remember what I was up to. Yes. Snake, the elevator's working. You fixed it? No, that's the weird thing. It just moved by itself. It's headed your way now. Is that so? Okay. That explosion before, what was it? Helicopter. Oh, I had to take out that helicopter. <clears throat> helicopter? That's incredible, Snake. Listen, no, it is. I just want to make sure again. This is the way to get to where Metal Gear is being stored? Yeah. The entrance to the underground maintenance base is towards the back of the snowfield ahead. Okay. <coughs> Find a safe place to hide out for a while. I'm going underground. I know, I know. You don't have to tell me. Underground levels. On way. Don't try to be a hero or anything. Okay. Call me if you need to. <clears> okay. <throat> so. Let's get this shit done. Level six, baby. We got the elevator, so that's good. Oh, the buttons there for a sec. That's why I was making sure I left this guard. Think of that. Maybe it's the elevator. I'm not going through this shit again, am I? Oh, you fucker. I feel like... I shouldn't have to go this way, but I feel like... Probably just gonna do it anyway and see what happens. I haven't got any rations. I'm gonna die. Uh, I might have fucked up here. I feel like I definitely fucked up. I'll probably die. I'll just keep running and see what happens. Next one should only have one on it. Let's see if this kills me. I feel like I should just die. There's no way. No matter what I do now though, I'm just gonna die. Unless there's rations on this fucking lift. Or elevator. Then I'm probably gonna just die. Lower that down because that looks like it's dead loud. It's redlining. Why not? Snake, there's something I forgot to tell you before. What? There were five stealth camouflage prototypes in my lab. Yeah, so? If you take out the one I'm wearing, that leaves four. Hey, this isn't first grade math class. I thought I'd get one for you. So I went back to the lab and... Yeah? The four suits were missing. Also, about the elevator that I checked out, it's really strange. It was like someone was intentionally holding it. When you were riding on it, did the weight limit warning go off? That's another thing that bothered me about it. I would the say that I've got fucking one by now. I couldn't be over the limit. How much do you weigh? About 
135, but that elevator had a weight limit of 650 pounds. It would take at least five people to go over that limit. Look out, Snake! The guys who stole my stealth prototypes are in there with you! Great. Too late, Snake! Now die! Well, I'm gonna be dead, aren't I? I killed none. Are you okay? No. So get me health back. If I get health back, I could be okay. Right. So we're back at this point. So do you know what I'm going to do here? Rather than me run down, I'm going to see if I can go through a different way because this shit's just going to be so difficult otherwise. I don't think there was another way off here though. No, is there? Fuck's sake! Wait. Electronic shaft... Uh, do I have any shaft grenades? Is that what I was using? Some. Hopefully I should be able to fuck these things up. Stop myself from getting shot. Kill the visible dudes. <coughs> That's done so long. He's gonna be in here with me, so. Oh, wait, guys, go in like. Boop. Huh? Cool, be cool, isn't it? Right, so what I'm gonna do here is think of. Think of a game plan. Snake. Easy peasy lemon squeezy. <clears throat> that just above me, or was it like? I 
station is always handy. This thing is always handy. Where am I going? That's not fucking handy. Wait, is it? Oh, it's right there. Really me! Wait, is this the room I was in earlier? Shut on the ass. Snake, are you okay? <clears throat> Otacon, were there any other stealth prototypes? No, there were only five. So, this isn't stealth camouflage then. What are you talking about? Someone's aiming at me in the middle of this blizzard. It's her. Wolf? Sniper Wolf? Yes, it's her. It's definitely her. Otacon, you sound like you're happy. No, I'm not. So then what is it? Snake, please don't kill her. Are you Fucking insane? Man. Please, she's a good person. You'd know that if you talked to her. Listen to me, kid. She's a merciless killer. I can see you perfectly from here. <laughs> I told you, I'd never quit the hunt. Now you're mine. Wolf, no, you can't. Don't get between a wolf and its prey. <clears throat> you're pretty good if you can hit me in this storm. You see, women naturally make better soldiers. Wolf, don't do this. Snake, I'm near. <laughs> can't you sense me near you? I smell. It's a mistake for a sniper Like you stepped in dog shit? Is that right? Well, I'm going to send you a love letter, my dear. Do you know what that is? It's a bullet straight from my gun to your heart. Please, Wolf! Snake, no! Quiet! Don't get in our way! Now I'm gonna pay you back for Meryl. You men are so weak. You can never finish what you start. I'm gonna shoot you in the ass. It may take 800 turns, but... Okay, she's fucking me up big time. Wait, hang on, I've got a sniper, haven't I? Oh wait, no, I don't want to face that way. I want to face this way. There she is. Where the bitch at? I've got no more rations, have I? No, have I? I have one. I have none. Do you not have any of me tablets, you bastard? Where is she? It's shit that I can't see it anyway because I can't fucking see what I need to do. She's just gonna kill me. Can I at least fucking move, you fucking melt? I mean, I'm tempted just to shoot you with an RPG, but I can't fucking see her. I think she's on the left of this, but... I don't know, because I fucking lie down every time. I'm gonna assume she's the... But I'm dead here, so I might as well just kill myself.
This isn't fun. Hopefully she just stays there. It's not that I've got... I haven't got any tablets, have I? Bit of a smoke. Because, like, obviously I'm not aiming particularly great. <clears throat> like, I don't move and he just fucking moves everywhere. That's the one issue. I wonder if she's the one she's running. As long as I'm faster than I'm shooting, then I should be alright. Other than this fucking... It's fucking with me, I'm not gonna lie. Go. Oh, don't go behind there, you daft bitch. I can't see you. Oh, thank you. I say I can't. Aim. Because I just need one shot, come on. One shot, just keep poking it out so I can hit it in the face. Yep. Yeah. That's why I'm just speed fucking shooting this now. Because, like I said, I don't know if he just does it all by himself. I've got like fucking none of them tablet things. Oh shit. That's PSG ammo, isn't it? There's a sniper scope. <laughs> it's still a snake. I'm gonna have to take these shots wisely now. Just have one. Oh. You gave me full half like you bastard. I waited for this moment. I am a sniper. Waiting is my job. Never moving a muscle. Concentrating. <laughs> I am long shot. You cannot save me. Please. Just finish me quick. So she's uh, like, literally. I have heard. <laughs> Ted. I have always dreamed of a peaceful place like this. A curd. It's Ed. So that's Ted. Called wolf. <clears throat> I was born on a battlefield, raised on a battlefield. Gunfire, sirens, and screams. They were my lullabies. Hunted like dogs, day after day. Driven from our ragged shelters. That was my life. Each morning I'd wake up and find a few more of my family or friends dead beside me. I stare at the morning sun. And pray to make it through the day. The governments of the world turned a blind eye to our misery. But then, he appeared. My hero. Me. Saladin. Oh, yeah, him. Mm -hmm. He took me away from all that. Saladin? 
You mean big boss? I became a sniper. Hidden. Watching everything through a rifle scope. Now I could see war. Not from inside, but from the outside. As an observer. I watched the brutality. The stupidity of mankind through the scope of my rifle. I joined this group of revolutionaries to take my revenge on the world. But I have shamed myself and my people. Need a bitch. I'm no longer the wolf I was born to be. In the name of vengeance, I sold my body and my soul. Now I am nothing more than a dog. Wolves are noble animals. They're not like dogs. In Yupik, the word for wolf is Keglinek. And the Aleuts revere them as honorable cousins. They call mercenaries like us dogs of war. It's true. We're all for sale at some price or another. But you're different. Untamed. Solitary. You're no dog. You're a wolf. Who are you? Steve. Are you Saladin? Wolf. You spared Meryl's life. She... she was never my real target. I, I don't kill for sport. Rest easy. You'll die as the proud wolf you are. <clears throat> I finally understand. I wasn't waiting to kill people. I was waiting for someone to kill me. He's got some big fucking ears on him. <laughs> Snake, you said that love could bloom on the battlefield. No, I couldn't save her. What are you doing? Taking a gun. <laughs> Returning it to its owner. I don't need a handkerchief. Why? I don't have any more tears to shed. <gasps> you do though, you little bitch. I'm going to the underground base. We're out of time. I know. You'll have to protect yourself now. Don't trust anyone. Yeah. If I can't stop Metal Gear, this whole place will probably be bombed to hell. Yeah. We might not meet again. I'll hang on to my codec. I want to keep helping. You can leave any time. Get a head start. A head start on your new life. Snake! What was she fighting for? 
What am I fighting for? What are you fighting for? If we make it through this, I'll tell you. Exnino walk. Okay. I'll be searching too. Ah. <sighs> uh, funny. I don't know why I found that so funny. It was just like a. Uh, okay. Well, I'll do that too. The action hero walked away. <coughs> I don't have a level 7 card. Hey, bitch, you got a level 7 card? No? Okay. I have a level 6, though. <laughs> Man. Taking a piss, come on. We're right here as well. We are over. Is the guy up here? Oh. Awesome. I'll do that. He's dead. Probably shouldn't do this much killing, but you know when you're just like, oh, I just feel like I need to do this much killing. It just happens. I knew you were gonna be in there hiding, you little shit. <clears throat> as well the foot terminate your thumbs up please uh, no we know what them it's only two people easy easy killings yo bitch give me your ass bitch Get the fucking lift stuff back up, like, but what we can we do about it? There's one more, don't it? Oh. 
posted up to you earlier, I'm not gonna lie. <clears throat> He's going all the way down there. Kind of going this way. Oh, shit. Yeah, I'm only kind of going this way in case it's like items that I should know about. What was that then? What was that then? I just picked up body what? Body armor. Ooh. I like that. I like that a lot. <clears throat> He was worth it. Told you he was gonna be worth it. case it fucking just takes me down automatically. So we're gonna get all this shit. Yep, that's all done. on the left kill and then I'm guessing. Damn. You have body armor now. Looks too better than one. Well, sorry, I'm sorry. Look at all the items. Yeah. 
No need for that behavior. Uh, shotgun. Let's throw that down here. Yeah, there's fucking mines down here as well. Why is it a mine just there? That no one can see. That's just like, that's, that's health and safety, that. Right, you know what? Shh! Chef! A boom. No, I'm saying it. I can't be asked to deal with it. It's only going to be our man. There he is! Okay, no? Are we not doing that? No? What the beds were. I'm not going to get attacked by the moment. I don't trust them. Never trust birds. <sighs> Snake, I've got something to tell you about Naomi Hunter. What about her? Is this conversation secure? Don't worry, the monitor's off. Okay, what's up? I was in the FBI too, you know. I didn't know that. What's your point? Dr. Hunter's story about her background, about her grandfather being an assistant secretary to Hoover in the FBI. Yeah. And then going undercover to investigate the Mafia in New York. Yeah, what about it? It was all a big lie. What did you say? I'm a bitch. It was really bothering me. Why would she lie about it? She lied. She might be a spy. Ridiculous. Come on, even a high school student could see past it. The head of the FBI at that time, Edgar Hoover, he was a well-known racist. Didn't Naomi say that her father was Japanese? Yeah. Well, back then, there wasn't a single Asian investigator. Also, in the 1950s, the undercover mafia sting operations hadn't even started yet. They first started in 1960, in Chicago, not New York. But you better check it out. The chief and the president mysteriously dying, and that ninja? Too many strange things are happening. Are you saying that Naomi might be behind it? I don't know. Either that, or she's working with the terrorists. Could it be? If I find out anything, I'll call. In the meantime, be careful. Mmm. What could it be? It's fucking bright out here, man. What the fuck? Wait. I'm sure there's no items here. But just always know, I'm just like such a fucking genius. It's like you just know the stuff gonna be there. There's a lot of items though, and I don't like it. I told you they were gonna talk. Oh shit. This is the end of the road for Remember you. Remember this guy. There's a little toy right, in the second friends. game. Listen, they agree. How dare you kill my friends? Ravens aren't scavengers like most people think. They're simply returning to the natural mm. world. That which is no longer needed. Sometimes they even attack wounded foxes. You were the one in the M1 tank? Must have been a tight fit for a big boy like you. <laughs> but 
that was no true battle. The evening I got long ago. Yeah, that makes the sense. Ravens and I were testing to see what kind of man you were. The judgment is decided. The ravens say you are a true warrior. Am I hallucinating? I can't move. The raven has put the mark of death upon you. Blood from the east flows within your veins. Uh, so fucking bright. Your ancestors too were raised on the barren plains of Mongolia. Inuit and Japanese are cousins to each other. We share many ancestors, you and I. I don't have any crows in my family tree. <laughs> you jest, but indeed ravens and snakes are not the best of friends. Nevertheless, you will make a worthy adversary. You best be an easy kill, because I'm not in for this bullshit. Too. The world Eskimo Indian Olympics. Yeah, I know it. <clears throat> Must be a real threat in the muck duck eating contest. Yes, you are right. But there is another event that I excel at. It is called the Ear Pull. It is an event where two opponents pull each other's ears while enduring the harsh cold. It tests spiritual as well as physical strength. You want to pull each other's ears? The form is different, but I have the spirit is the on. same. Rejoice, Snake! Ours will Not be a glorious man. battle. This isn't glorious. It's just plain killing. Violence isn't a sport. Well, we'll see if there is iron in your words. No. I'm gonna fucking kill this controller. I fucking hate this bullshit. I'm open. I'll just start shaking the boss fight because I'll fucking cry otherwise. That's the first. I can just skip through it. So. Alright, those work. Like another fun hand, I got the battle on it. It was a noise room, was it originally? No, I need to just move. It's like a shit game of Mega Man, this.
actually quite scary watching this. I can't see a fucking thing. Okay then, see you still in love. Snake, take this security card. It will open that door. Why? <laughs> you are a snake which was not created by nature. You and the boss. You are from another world. A world that I do not wish to know. Sound. Go and do battle with him. I will be watching from above. First, I'll give you a hint. The man who you saw die before your eyes. What is it? That was not the Darpa Chief. Was decoy octopus, a member of Foxhound. Mm. He was a master of disguise. He copied his subjects down to the blood. So he drained the chief's blood and took it into himself. Deep. But he wasn't able to deceive the angel of death. The angel of death. But why go to so much trouble? Why impersonate the chief? <laughs> that is the end of my hint. You must solve the rest of the riddle yourself. Snake. In the natural world, there's no such thing as boundless slaughter. There's always an end to it. But you are Grim. different. What are you trying to say? The path you walk on has no end. Each step you take is paved with the corpses of your enemies. Their souls will haunt you forever. You shall have no peace. But give me a level seven fucking thing. Hear me, snake. My <clears throat> spirit will be watching you. Have you been eating stuff? No, yeah. It's just all bones. Snake, it's me, Master. It's about Naomi. Turn your monitor off. What about Naomi? <clears throat> Colonel, is Naomi there? No, she's away. She's taking a short nap. Hmm. So what is this about Naomi? 
Okay. Maybe we'd better let the Colonel hear this, too. Yeah. Go on, Master. Well, basically, Dr. Naomi Hunter is not Dr. Naomi Hunter at all. What? I thought her story of her background sounded kind of fishy, so I checked it out. And? There is an actual Dr. Naomi Hunter, or I should say, there was one. But she's not the woman we know. The real Naomi Hunter disappeared somewhere in the Middle East. Our Naomi must have somehow obtained her identification papers. So then, who is she really? She must be some kind of... spy. A spy? Yes. Maybe she's been sent to sabotage this operation. Are you saying she's with the terrorists? I don't want to believe it either, but she is working for Foxhound. So you think she had a part in the uprising? Or she could be working with some different group altogether. Mm -hmm. Different group? It couldn't be. Place her under arrest. What? She's betrayed us. She needs to be arrested and interrogated to find out who she's with. If she's one of their spies, then we're in big trouble. What do you mean? Oh, nothing. Have you let her in on some kind of vital secret or something? Does this have anything to do with the mysterious deaths of the DARPA chief and the arms tech president? I... I have no idea. Anyway, we cannot allow her to participate any further in this mission. Wait, wait a minute. Without her, we can't complete this mission. I knew it. You were hiding something. Give me some time. I'll try to get it out of her. I'm going to time. Right, We've got to figure out who she is and what she's doing here. I understand. Snake, give me some time. I don't have any time left for you. He ain't happy, he ain't happy.